In this experiment, we will perform solar water splitting. In essence, we will convert light energy into chemical energy. Sunlight will be used to generate hydrogen directly from water. Hydrogen is a clean fuel source because when it is burned or used in a fuel cell, the only byproducts are energy and water. We will be using a silicon solar cell to first convert light into electrical energy, and that energy will be used to split water and produce hydrogen gas, our fuel, and oxygen, a harmless byproduct. The setup includes two pencils, which will act as electrodes, along with a jar and a cap, then sodium sulfate, which acts as our electrolyte, a spatula to stir the sodium sulfate, water, and of course, our photovoltaic solar cell. First, you will carefully pour the sodium sulfate electrolyte into the container. After that, you'll take the water and pour it into the container as well. Next, stir the electrolyte until it is completely dissolved. You may have to stir for a while. Next, add the cap to the jar and slide the pencils in through the two holes on top of the jar. Once in place, take the alligator clips that are connected to the solar cell and connect each one to one of the pencils. Make sure that the metal clips of the alligator clamp are fully touching the graphite portion of the pencil. Now observe as each pencil produces small bubbles. This is the result of water splitting. At one pencil electrode there is hydrogen gas being produced. This is the fuel gas that could be used, for example, to drive a hydrogen powered car. At the other pencil we are producing oxygen as the byproduct.